to my channel. We're here in Market Market, and look who it is. AC, yeah, hey, look at her outfit, look at her outfit, look at her outfit, look at that. Wow, look at that, wow, amazing, amazing. <laughs> Guys, I'm still so hungover from last night, so let's get some juice here to uh, help help us. How are you doing anyways? Do you have a hangover? No, I don't. No, you shouldn't have, I don't know. Is that coconut? Is this coconut? No, it's guyabana. What's that? I don't know how is it so English. What does that mean? Look at these. Is it sweet? Oh, look at that. Look at that guys, fresh mango drink. Alright. Well, she just she just got me this uh, mango drink here. Oh god, that's so refreshing. What do you think? Mm. Wow, all right. Well, that's gonna start our day going. Check it out, guys, market, market. Okay, so by the way, so that costed 80 pesos, which is $1.36 for some fresh mango. Real deal here, guys. It's a hot day now. I thought it was gonna rain. It's starting to get windy. I was like, oh no, that's not good. But then, turns around. And it's a hot, sun's coming out, blue skies. Here we go. Hopefully, keep that way. Keep it that way, right? Should put sunscreen on. I put a lot of bug spray, though. So. Hi, guys. Hey. Hey. You got something to say? Mm. No? We're back. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We are. Can't open the door? Major? Yeah. You got it? Alright. Everyone, so now we are headed to. Where are we headed to? <laughs> <laughs> Fort Santiago in Intramuros, guys. My favorite. And of course, I did say my favorite. But this is actually one of my favorites. Of course, I said that already too. So we'll just say it's a good place. A really good place. Lots of history. I love the history here in the Philippines. So let's go check it out. I need some energy, guys. I, I'm hoping that juice would help me. Yeah. All right, let's get going. Long ride. So she's gonna change my screen for me, and she got me this new case. Check this out, everybody. That's amazing. By the way, we have the same phone here. About the same. This is what I had before, just a tempered glass. And this is like some professional type right here. Very, very good. Right? Amazing. Thank you so much. Hey. You're welcome. <laughs> Alright, we'll check it out guys. There it is. <laughs> okay guys, so let me just tell you what happened. The son of a bitch, uh, taxi driver, missed Fort Santiago. So he's going all around and he's trying to make the meter go up. And I'm saying, absolutely not. That is ridiculous. You pull up your maps and we're going the opposite direction. You, you, got, you know, you got to always be on guard in, in this country, all right? Especially if you're a foreigner, always be on guard. Seriously. You agree, right? You saw what was happening. That was complete bullshit unacceptable don't let that don't ever let that happen to you guys know where you're going go on maps and figure figure it out because this i'm telling you he's going the opposite direction and he's expecting us to pay more no 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 anyways we have arrived here at <laughs> intermural <laughs> 
So yeah, we're here guys. Uh, let's go explore this place. Check this out guys. So here's the World War II Jeep right here. It hasn't been converted into a uh, Jeepney yet, but there's the idea. Look at that. Hey guys, so I just want to let you guys know all the history in this area, intramurals, is filled with history of history. I'm telling you, we're going back generations and generations through the Spanish colonies, through the American Filipino War, Spanish American War, all of that, guys. All happened here up until World War II ja and the Japanese. All of that, guys. So much history. I've been studying it over and over again. Before, I didn't know how much history there was, but then once I got back home to LA, I did so much research on it and I found out, like, wow, wow, if these streets could talk, you know? And the architect, too. It's all like Spanish co uh, colony, co colony, colony, right? Colony? Col colonial, colonial, whatever, whatever the hell it is. I don't know. But the problem here, let me tell you another problem, guys, is. It's like Mexico, guys. You get harassed a lot. Because it's like a tourist area, of course. It's one of their biggest tourist areas. So you see white gringo guy, they're like, oh, money, 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 money. But little do they know, I don't have any. So that's why you need to go hit up my PayPal and support my travels here, here in the Philippines to provide the best of the best content. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Look at these buildings. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Watch it, watch out, watch out. Yeah. Filming here. Look at this. Look at the history. The history of all of this, amazing. Incredible, right? This is what it is right here. The Church of Our Lady of Moretas. 1891 here. So that's why it looks so old, yeah. Up until 1945, which was the Battleman Outlook, it says right here. I don't even, <laughs> I already knew the history, see? All right, read it, read it, look at this. First church constructed in 18, was replaced by construction of the second church. And this is during the Philippine Spanish War. And then destroyed during the Second World War II by bombs. Bombs by the Japanese. Always restore it. Yeah, always restore it. Look at this. History, guys. I'm telling you, look at this. I love it. This is why I love it here, because of all this interesting history. It's called General Luna. You know who General Luna is? He's the uh, general. Hold on, come here. Come here. I'm teaching you. I'm teaching about Filipino history. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm the one who's supposed to. You're the one supposed to, but I already did my research. So General Luna is the general during the uh, American-Filipino War. He is one of the, your best generals possible. Even the Americans loved him. They thought he was one of the best generals ever. So General Luna, I even watched the movie. Mm -hmm. General Luna. Yeah, and uh, Goya, Goya, the, the younger general as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's check this out. Let's see when this was built. The, the first Jesu compound, 1581. Wow. 1581. Wow. Hold on, look. Read this. Read all this history right here. Wow. Converted into military barracks. That's this, 1880, occupied by U.S. Army. Okay, so this is American-Filipino War. Destroyed during the Second World War. I don't know what this is. This is Vietnam? But wow, wow. Look at this place. Is this, oh, this is the church. Is this the Manila Church? Hey, I'm talking to you. <laughs> That's the Manila Catrita. Then what, what is this? What is this? Oh, she saved me. I almost got hit. Because I'm very concerned on what this this history place is right here. I don't know what this is. I don't know what it is either, but it looks old. I guess it's the box. Yeah. Look at this door. Look at the craftsmanship on this. Wow, look at this, guys. Wow. Oh my gosh. Where'd she go? Oh, she gonna take, hold on. Oh, <laughs> Everybody right. wants to take photos with me? Alright. Wow. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> All right, bye bye, bye bye, bye bye, bye bye. You too. All right, guys. So I uh, just got recognized there. Famous YouTuber out here, of course. See, I told you people want to take videos with me. So yeah. You want you want a photo? Look, look, look. You want a photo of me? All right, all right. We got more photo, more photos. All right. Alright, so what's your name? Joshua. Nice to meet you. I'm Nate Vlog. What's your name? Yeah, I'm from LA. We out here. Uh, so yeah, Manila. Alright. Bye-bye. Alright, check it out. Check out more buildings, guys. More buildings. Everybody everybody wants to uh, take a picture with me. Check it out, Caballo. Oh, that's okay. Poor horse. Look at him. He's about to like croak. Little horse has to. Oh, I'm gonna get hit by a car. Look at that. Oh, guys, I'm starting to sweat like crazy now. Just, uh, sweaty foreheads for sure. But we're still going, guys. We're still going through this. Have an amazing time here. Adventure through all this history. Back in time, you'd think we're in Spain or something like that, but no. This is the Philippines. This is Manila. Don't you forget that. Oh, I love it. I love it here. Oh my god. Almost fell. Look at this, guys. It smells so nasty over here. Stinkies. But just check out this building here. Incredible, right? So since you're an architect, what do you think of all this architecture? Of course it's good because it has a cool Speak history. up, speak up. No mumbling. No mumbling. Come on. What do you got to say? Well, I can say that this architecture is really good because you can see all this historical stuff here and yeah. they're restoring all of this and sometimes that if there's a broken thing here, they restore it. Right, and restore it. it. Yeah, they'll just, you know, you have to remain it like the original form. Exactly, original. No, no, no. No, 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 no iPhone, no iPhone. Yeah, we already have. That's stolen too. That's a stolen iPhone. Yeah. Stolen. Remember that. If somebody tries to sell you a phone here, it's stolen. Good thing we got that on camera. There it is, the Manila Cathedral, guys. Look at the history. Here's the history. Copyright music. 1571. Cheese, mango, strawberry. Cheese, mango, strawberry. Yeah, no. No, that's okay. No, thank you. Is this Pico? Quanto cuesta? 20. Oh, he knew what that means. <laughs> he knew what that meant. Check it out, we're getting some Biko here. How many girls? No, this one. Only one? Yeah, only one. Perfect. All right, let's try some free, fresh Biko. Cheers, thank you, by the way. She's always buying me everything, huh? Ah, oh, oh, that is a refreshing. Oh. Look at these Catholics. On all. Look, look at them, look at them. Who are these guys? These guys look important. There you go. Hello. All right, boys. Look at this door right here. Massive, they love massive doors here. Look at that. What, what? Oh, she's taking a photo of me. Look at that, guys. Look, look, right here, vlogging. We're here. 
sauna on. Check this out, guys. They're changing a uh, shoehorn. Okay, horseshoe, horseshoe. Horseshoe, yeah, horseshoe. That's what it's called, horseshoe. Look at that. It's named Bandoy. 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 It's a warfare. There you go, caballo. 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 Caballo named Rambo. Yeah. He's also Chinese. Surname is Tan. <laughs> really? Rambo, Tan. Right on. <laughs> Rabotan, all right, all right. I know, I love Rabotan. I love Rabotan. I know that fruit. It's the alien fruit. The red one. Man, we're getting some amazing content right now. Amazing. Love it. Yeah. Okay, guys, here we are. We finally made it to Fort Santiago. Let's get these tickets and go in. I wonder how much they're going to be this time. Lots of walking. Here we go, everybody. Good day today. Everybody's all staring at me again. Everybody wants my photo. Look at that. Giggles, giggles. So here's our tickets here. These are the price to get in. 75 pesos is like a dollar something. So, yeah, yeah. Okay, here we are. Here's your ticket. Memories. 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 Ticket, uh, ticket, ticket. What nationality? American. Thank you very much. American. You're American? <laughs> I'm American. Yeah. I guess you're American? No. <laughs> you're Japanese. from Spain too? Yeah, she's from Spain, I guess so. Look at all this history. You know this place is haunted, right? You know it's haunted? Yeah. Do you know? Yeah. Do you know? Everything here is haunted. Good. You're paying attention. Hey, take a photo of me. Okay, I'll take a photo of you. Okay. okay. Can I go there? You go there. Remember, I know what to do now. I know what to do now. Okay, look, look, she's guiding me. She's a photographer, guys, so she knows she gets mad that I don't know how to take photos. But then again, I'm a videographer. Oh, geez, where is she going? How far are you? How far are you gonna go? You want me to walk? Oh, you're walking towards me. Okay. All right, go ahead. Oh, skipping around. Look at that, guys. Look at it. Look at her skipping around. Did I take good photos? Yeah, it sure is. Look at the last what? photo guy. Look, look at the last one, guys. So <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Go check one. out her Instagram, guys. These are from bombings. The bombs. In a tunnel. Is this a dungeon? <laughs> it's just a tunnel. It's a little dark in here. Yeah. Check it out, a golf course. Oh. Wow, that's such a good photo. Golf course. Yeah. Right, what's all this about? guys more photos very slippery place right here on this green whatever this is dangerous anything for a photo right though that's why you got to make sure to hit up my Instagram I my sweat off right now thank you so long mm -hmm. look at that all sweat <laughs> Check out this cannon right here, guys. I wonder how old this thing is. Look at that. Just getting prepared. Boom. Here's like a watchtower right here. Not a tower, but watch area. Sitting on a cannon right now, figuring out the photos that we take. It's all about photos. <laughs> Trust me, I love it. I love it, but like, 
she's really serious about photos. She, she's a she's a, a photographer, so if I don't do it right, oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just want you to have a good photo in your face. Right. I don't want to ruin your face. You have a beautiful face. Aww, so sweet. Wow, look at this. This was all destroyed by bombing. Uh oh, more photos, guys. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> I have a photo here last time. I was like standing like this, posing. I was like, this, this thing right here, whatever this is, this doorway. Aesthetic. All right, fine. You don't want to know? All right, fine. Okay, now we're entering <laughs> where the barracks were of the Americans. Just think, this is where they all used to be. America. Well, to build a museum and library as a dedicated repository of World War II archives, documents, and relics. Oh, this museum goal. will be a state of the art multimedia institution aimed at not just education and learning, but more importantly, aim honor our glorious past and inspire our future generations. Thank you for reading that. <laughs> nice job. I like the word state of the art. State of the art. Because you're an architect. <laughs> I shall return. Guys, if the Americans didn't come back and save the, the Filipinos, she would be Japanese right now. Think about that. Japanese? Yeah, be Japanese. You go height. Hi. Hi. But no, she's not. All right, guys. Well, what you just walked through right here, intramuros, this is it back in 1941. Right when the World War II started. Because at uh, December 7th is when they bombed Pearl Harbor. So, yeah. The beginning of the war for the U.S. And look, this is what we just walked through getting here. This is how it used to be. Wow, unbelievable. Now, is this the cathedral? I think this is... That's a different one? Oh. Check it out guys. The Philippine army right here. They got some shorts on. There we go. Amazing, huh? Oh, well, you got some tribal guys. Oops, sorry. Just cut in front of you. Philippine army. Oh, look. They got biplanes. These are called biplanes. Right? I think they are. <laughs> Good. Look at this. Look at this. You know what these are? You know what these are? Large bullets. Large bullets. Large bullets. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> this is what they put in the howitzers. Think of that. Look at this. Getting shot by one of these. like a bullet. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. No, no, no. That's older. That's older. This is World War II here. This is like Spanish. Yeah. There it is, guys. The famous uh, coat of arms and everything. Spanish rule. There's a picture of uh, a Sherman tank going through this. Somewhere around here. But anyways, it's, it's like that, yeah. Look at that. Any koi fish in there? If this was Japan, there would be koi fish in there. But nope, it's not Japan. Tracked a little bit. We had to get some water. Oh, whoa, there, there goes the water. <laughs> You're dehydrated too? Did that quench your thirst? Look, it almost. Wow. Wow. <laughs> well, there goes that. Jeez. There's All right. Tree right here, guys. I wonder how old this thing is. Look at that. Look at that. Look at it. Look at this. 
<laughs> yeah. All right. You speaking English? You can find one of the largest bolita tree in the province of Aurora. You can, it is considered as one of the biggest bolita tree in Asia. Wow. Yeah, you can find it in Aurora province. That's incredible. I was not expecting she would know what this was. It's a tree. Can you yeah, believe it? Tree. It was like if you uh, in the tree, yeah. you need more of like 800 people. Right. That's how big it is. So big. 800 people, like. Yeah, like big. Yeah, whatever we're doing. What's that? What does that mean? <laughs> Look, it's the pigeons. Pigeons hang out here. Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson loves pigeons. Look at the aesthetic here, huh? Yeah, that's nice. That's a good spot right there to take photos. Oh gosh, more photos. More photos. Yeah, it's huge. It's huge. I mean, this is a fort, you know? It's a big, massive fort. Rizal guy. He, uh, this is uh, this is where his jail cell was, right in here, over here. Let me show you. And uh, he was a philosopher and a doctor for the Philippines. Oh, oh, she she wants to put her word in. <laughs> He's an architect as well. Yeah. Oh, of course, she knows that. <laughs> she designed one of the buildings that they are going to uh, be their, their post, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Well, anyways, so yeah. Uh, he was for the Philippines against the Spanish rule in the Spanish-Philippine War in 1890-something. Almost 1900. Yeah, this is it right here. Here it is. See? There he is. I told you would finally. He's a little short guy. Look at that. It looks real, huh? Really small guy, huh? Super short. Look at him. I feel like he's going to start moving soon. You know, if you look hard enough, you stare at him, he's going to move. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. Creepy. But yeah, this is where he uh, stayed until his execution. See how much actually, I know so much? I think he actually has a long name, original long name. Yeah, but we don't have time for that. <laughs> His name is Jose Protasio. Jose Protasio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah, exactly. But anyways, that's your guy right there. That's your okay, guy. Okay, everybody, now we're headed to the dungeon right now. We gotta crawl through. This is... Yeah, yeah, we gotta go down in there. It's very eerie. Yeah, yeah, we gotta go in there. Okay, here we go. Oh, back problems. Oh my gosh. Ow. Shit. Oh gosh. You alright? Your head okay? You hit your head? Look at this. All the Filipinos. Sad, huh? Mm -hmm. All right here. Four hundred and fifty Filipinos found dead on this uh, Fort San Diego cell. Men are spaced ten feet apart and show depth of the cell. Nineteen forty seven, so right after the war of course. Jeez. Look at this. Oh my gosh, look at what the Japanese did to them. Women and children killed by bayonet and rifle fire in Walled City, Manila, Philippines. Jeez. Wow, look at them. It's, oh my gosh. So sad. 
Oh, look at all the bodies lined up. Oh my gosh. So this is where we were. Look at that. Look at the bombing. Look at that. Can you, can you pick that up on camera? Can you see that? Wasteland. This is where we were. This is intramurals. Look at them. Just dead on the street like that. What the Japanese did. How's that make you feel? Sad, huh? You still talking? So many people suffered. Imagine being trapped down here. Oh gosh. And here comes the American soldiers right here. We're coming through, saving you guys. Here we go. Check it out. American troops move into intramural section of Manila. Right at the end of the war, right here. To get rid of those Japanese. Look at that. Sherman tanks. Look at this guy. This is, wow. Ooh, spiders, spiders. Okay, yeah, oh, as far as I'm going. Okay, here's the exit here. You good? Yeah. All right, it's so hot, I'm sweating like crazy right now. Jeez, imagine being stuck down there. 450 prisoners. Oh gosh, that's crazy. Ah, oh, fresh air, fresh air. I can't even breathe down there. Imagine they're burnt, flamethrowers, all of that. All in here, dungeons and dungeons. Okay, now we made it to the Pasig River right here. Oh, what's in here, guys? Ooh, that looks really eerie. Oh, look at that in there. That's creepy. Probably another dungeon. Ooh, you hear that? Wow. That's scary. Okay, let's keep moving. <laughs> There's fish in here? You would eat fish in here? There's no way. That's, oh, yeah, there's a fish right there. That's a janitor fish, but it is not edible. What is it? A janitor fish. Janitor? Yeah, it is not edible. How do you but know? I don't even see it. In Raqqa, you can also see, also see the Pasig River. Oh, yeah? Yeah, right across the street. Really? And people also there do fishing. And sometimes they cut up like bangush or what you call the milkfish. It is only exclusive here in the Philippines. You I can only that. find bangus here in the Philippines. Yeah. You're so informative. There's lots of information out of this girl. Also, oh, you she's can still get going. other fish from here like tilapia. Tilapia? Yeah, tilapia. yeah, I don't know about eating that here. You can you can find that kind of fish in tropical countries. No. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. I look so tired now. I don't want to show my face. <laughs> so this is the tondo right here, so which is called the uh, slums of Manila here. The poor of the poor, but then again, you get these high rises here, so they're trying to build it up, as you can see, they're trying to make it better. But, but you, you yeah, move those slum area because yeah. every part of the Philippines has a slum area. Yeah, because as you know, this is one of the third world countries. This That's is a third world country. one of the poorest. That's why it's rare to find a uh, rich girl here. Oh. Train here. Look at this! Too steep. Too steep, yeah. Can't, I cannot climb that at all. Do you want me to try to You want to climb? Yeah, okay. Oh, wow. Okay. She's going to climb, guys, just for the video. Ah, oh, lighting, lighting. Wow, you did it. 
Okay. Oh. Okay. You did it. Good girl. Don't hurt yourself. <laughs> oh my gosh. I yeah. Wow. All right. Good job. Come back down, hon. <laughs> All right. Watch your step. Easy. Easy. Oh, jeez. There you go. Easy does it. Yep. Oh. All right, good, good, you did it. Good girl. Look at that. Wear a mask at all time. Yeah, right. You think we listen to rules around here? Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> oh, but this girl is. What are you doing? <laughs> hey. There you go. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Wow. We're gonna wrap this up. So that is Fort Santiago, an amazing place. Highly, highly, highly recommend this. If you guys are into history and the aesthetic of uh, original Philippines in Manila, what how it all started from the Spanish rule to up until uh, Americans and then the Japanese. So there you go. Anyways, so now we are gonna head and get something to eat because I am starving. You're starving too, right? Yeah, I'm so hungry. Yes, yes, we're both very hungry. Starving. Let's get it. More food. Yay! Bye guys. <laughs> no, 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 no buy. No buy. No right, buy. We're exiting now. Look at this. Oh no. Oh no. Tuk tuks. Oh no, that's okay. I wish, but. They can't take us to Makati because we're headed to Makati right now to go eat. Oh my god, almost get a hot hit by a jeepney here. Look at them all lined up. Those are fun, I'm telling you, those are really fun. But they, they can't take us to where we're going. Oh my gosh. Ah. Ah. <laughs> so we got to find like a taxi. We're going to take a tuk tuk. 100. 100. 100. 100. 1,000. No, 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 no. Hinde, Hinde. Hinde, Hinde, Hinde. All right, guys, we're in a tuk tuk now. I love this. 100, 100. 100, 100. <laughs> All right. Yeah, of course. Make sure we don't fall out. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love these so much. <laughs> Crazy driver. Crazy. Masama. Yeah. Yeah. That's scary. Okay, check this out, guys. Hold on, check this out. KKK. Look at that. What does that KKK mean? That's awesome. How can I get Where the hell are we now? <laughs> We're in SM Manila. SM Manila? SM Manila? What are we doing here? Hey, my friend. Hey. Okay. How's it going? <laughs> thank you. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. All right, more photos. More photos, guys, more photos. We're getting, we're getting so many photos here because I'm famous here. <laughs> so yeah, we out here. Okay. Now we need to find a, uh, a taxi to get to Makati. Because Makati is my home base. All right, check it out, we, we got a taxi now. Let's not get conned this time, right? 
<laughs> no, but you know, we know what's going on around here. We're smart now. All right, so what's this called? It's called Chicharron. Chicharron? Yeah, it is one of my favorite snacks, Chicharron. I always have it in my bag, so in my room. It's the skin of... A pork. Pork. A pork, pork skin. skin. It's actually crispy. Crispy. And yeah. tasty. All right, let's give it a try, guys. First time trying this. Here we go, this is what it looks like. That's so unhealthy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I tried it. It's crunchy. Oh, I'm good. You don't like it? No. <laughs> <laughs> and that's famous in Mexico. I think they do it in Spain as well. Obviously, that's probably where they learned it from. But yeah, really famous in Mexico, for sure. All right, well, anyways, head into Makati. See you there. Hey, guys, I prefer, I prefer to it's cheaper price and it's reasonable. Yeah. So we came across a market here. Look at that. Look at all the markets. Don't worry guys, it's clean. <laughs> yeah, are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Sure. Wow, this is the real not, Philippines here. Probably not. Wow, look, the fish market. Look at that fish. Pescado. This, that, that is the tilapia, what I'm saying. Tilapia. Yeah, yeah, that's it. This is bamboos. It's all pescado. Oh, chicharron, I think that's chicharron yeah, right there. Chicharron. Yeah. Oh, there is uh, the buco. buco. It's already in the yolk. When you, Dirty when ice a, cream. Yeah, when a buco is old, yeah. you can call it ni yolk. And what do you do with it? Throw it away? No, you can get uh, you still milk use it? there. Really? Coconut milk. You can extract a coconut milk. Really? That. Yeah. Oh, you're so educated. You know everything. Mm, of course, everybody knows that. Big sacks of rice. What? Rice. Like a fries fair. No, like they're selling rice, like big sack of rice. Oh yeah. Wow. Look at all this. So <laughs> interesting. Alright. Perfect. Here we are. Let's uh thank you, Salama. Oh, Alright. You got everything? Alright. We're here guys, we made it to Makati. Oh. Oh. We got everything, yeah, got everything. This is my second home, guys, here on P. Burgo Street. You would think, uh, you would think this is my original home. Well, it should be, right? Right. Well, we're gonna try the filling station for the very first time. Wow, lots of filling in here. This is gonna be a long video. Two? Two? Copyright music, copyright music. Bye bye, everybody. Look at this place. James Bond. Goldfinger. That's a good one. So much to see. Look at this. There's Elvis. Elvis. You know who that is? Guys, look at this place. This is incredible. Oh my gosh. There's just stuff everywhere. Wow. Oh my gosh. Where do we go? Where do we go? Oh my gosh, look at all this. Sorry, right, sorry. Right. Just bumping into people. Ah, look at that outfit. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that. Wow. That's nice right there. Wow. Oh my gosh. This, this should just be a whole separate video here. Seriously, oh my, look at this place. Look at all this. It just, it's just so much to see. We can spend hours here looking at everything. Wow. A star trooper. Wow, 
look at the look at the vending machine. Oh so much. So much. I can't take it. I can't take it too much in here. Looks like we're in the Maryland Moreau uh, section. Right, check it out, guys. This is a massive menu. We got milkshakes. Look at all this. So much. So much. Copyright music. So, anyways, we ordered so much to choose from. Everything looks amazing. So, I got the burger, of course, because it's all American. And you got some type of like big appetizer thing, which has a variety of different items. So, all right, copyright. All right, check this out, guys. So, here's our burger here. That's what she ordered. Okay, I'm starving. I gotta get. What the hell? Look at this burger, guys. Oh, it's a double burger. It's a double burger. Oh my gosh. No napkins. Okay, everyone. Sorry I couldn't really film in there. It's just the copyright music was blasting. The burger was amazing. I loved it so much. One of the best burgers I ever had. Go check it out. How was your food? It's good. It was good, yeah. And and yeah, oh my gosh, the, I I could have made a whole video by itself in there, just looking at everything. There's so much, <laughs> so much history in there. Incredible. All right, guys. Kirby vibes. By the way, that meal cost you twenty-five dollars. That's two meals and a milkshake. So you let me know if that's a good deal or not. Yeah, I mean it's a little expensive, but. You know, it's different. Yo, look who I came across. Good evening. Marty McCarty. I'm here with Nate. Nate Vlog. All right, cheers, man. Cheers. And by the way, I'm hanging off the alcohol. This is just tomato juice. Right, of course. All right. Sticking to it. Now, the waitresses are really lazy tonight. I'll tell you why, because the boss is not here. Now, if you swing over there, oh, no, actually, but I don't know if you're allowed to. I don't know who cares anyway, it doesn't matter. There's a whole bunch of this. Uh, how many TVs? One, two, three, four. Hold on, five, where are six, we though? Seven, where are we located? Oh, here we're in McCarty, obviously, because we're doing the whole McCarty thing. Of course. Um, and what's this, what's this bar called? Uh, it's called Shooter's Bar, and Shooter's it's new. Bar. It used to be called Team Insider, and they shut the place down and emptied the whole place. There wasn't a single screw left even. Yeah. And they've reopened the whole thing. So, um, yeah, it's a really nice bar. It's cool. It's, it's, it's uh, family welcome friendly. Uh, you know, I had my kid here yesterday. Uh, if you look at my channel, uh, Marty McCarty, uh, someone kidnapped my kid. Well, oh my god. Yeah, and I uh, took him for a walk without asking us. So the whole bar freaked out. It was, it was crazy. Yeah, uh, if you have a look at, uh, actually, you videoed it all. Yeah. And um, he got in big trouble. And it was, ended up being a security guard. So I went to the door, and um, the people, the smoking area, he went outside the smoking area, and there's an exit there. And I said, Have you seen a little, a little kid, a little, little white guy? He's three years old. It said, Some guy had him by the hand. Oh my and god. And I'm like, What the fuck? And I'm thinking, he's straight away taking him to a car. There goes my kid. My wife and I are freaking out, we're jumping all over oh, the yeah. place. Yeah, it was really, really, really bad. And, um, yeah, so, yeah, so in the end he came back and the boss just ripped him a new, new asshole, really. So he got big, big shit for that. You don't just take someone to keep it that You don't do you. that. Or tell him, you don't do that. Literally. Anyone out, there, anyone out there that's got kids, even if you don't, imagine your kid just goes missing from the restaurant you're in. You know, like, we all freaked out so much. So anyway, um, putting that aside, um, yeah, we, we decided uh, the, the, the staff here were getting lazy because the, the boss is not here. So I went up to the, the counter and I stole this. <laughs> so when I want something now, oh, they're all going to come now. I told them, when I ring this, oh, oh, sorry, no, it's good, it's good. Yeah, that's good. Throw it. <laughs> I'm joking. Yeah. Stop that. <laughs> anyway, uh, this, so this here, um, I'm off the alcohol. So I've had too many bad experiences lately. Um, 
out of order. Yeah, so I'm having a, like a, probably a six month break off the alcohol. Been really good. And um, yeah, so anyway, back to that. Nate's uh, mom's been watching uh, his channel and he goes who's that crazy tattoo guy face he goes who are you hanging out with there in the philippines <laughs> and um there's a story behind this and, uh, and nate wanted me to, to elaborate on it so so basically um i got i got a little bit of ink here you know like a, a bit and i've got my son's names and that's all cool but for god's sake my, my mom and said why did you tattoo your face you know what, what the fuck were you thinking but anyway the story behind it goes like this uh we were out at a bar and I was hanging out with these tattooed girls and uh, everyone said don't go with them, they're dangerous, you know. In the end, uh, I wake up, I wake up uh, in this hotel room, totally, I don't know, blind. I think they put something in my drink. My whole face is like, I wake up, it's all sore and red and tattooed. Uh, I didn't, I didn't sign up for this. So anyway, um, I got up out of the bed and I was all delirious. They put something in my drink. I don't do drugs at all. No way. Never have in my life, never will. Not even, not even uh, MJ. So anyway, I got up delirious, fell down the stairs and broke my leg in two places. Ended up in hospital with a, with a red face and uh, I broke my tibula and fibula, uh, which is, if you can look at your leg, which is this bone here and that bone there. And I, and, and I was walking on it. I didn't even realize I broke it until so I went to, until it started swelling up. Oh so then God. I had to go to the hospital and get set. So for, for a whole six months, uh, I was in pain. So, um, you know, real stupid shit can happen here. So you have to be really vigilant and careful. So, um, anyway, I think I've talked enough right now. I want to enjoy my tomato juice and, and talk to my friends here. Right. But uh, right now, we are signing out. Don't forget to click like and subscribe. Right on. All right. On. Cool. Right on. Peace yeah. out. All right. Cheers. Yeah, that, was a good, that was a good one. Cheers. Oh, look, at, look at your drawing you just did. Wow. Look at that. All right, so we just finished up Shooter's Bar. Yeah. Now we're so walking. now we're walking, all walking across and here in uh, Makati. Over to a place called Token Bar. All right. And this is the owner here is, uh, he's Korean and his name's James and he's drunk tonight. He was just in the bar we came from. Yeah. So um, we're going to shoot some billiards. Yeah. Well, let's do it. All right, careful, careful, right. careful. These cars, they don't give a shit. So we got a spiral staircase to go. So if you're drunk, just be careful here, mate. All right. It smells here like stinkies. Yeah, stinkies. stinkies. Okay, everybody, so it's a little crowded right now. Everybody's shooting pool right now. Check it out. Everybody. So, uh, got our waters here. So, uh, yeah. Too crowded. Uh, okay, guys, just a ride back at my place. Uh, I need to get up early tomorrow and change my location. Unfortunately, my time's up here, so new condo coming soon. All right, Nate Vlog, signing out. Make sure you go hit up my PayPal. It's such a good day. Love to support Santiago. So much history, everybody. Incredible. All right, I'm done. I'm wasted. I'm yeah, all right, later. Big video. All right, see ya.